There seems to be no slowdown for the bearish momentum in the crypto markets at the moment. We can see another red day for cryptocurrency. Bitcoin is now down to 25.9K with Ethereum hovering around 1.65K. Fingers crossed we don't see more negative continuation. In this video, we will look at four coins some people might miss whilst they're on their summer vacations. We know August is very much known for being a very slow month in cryptocurrency as well as September. We can see lots of coins are very, very red on the week and of course the day as well so let's check it out because with fear presents opportunity for dollar cost averaging before we get into these coins let's look at some headlines that's happened in the news so far so ethereum co-founder vitalik buterin sends one million dollars worth of ethereum to coinbase vitalik buterin transferred over one mil to the crypto exchange very very recently just this monday we don't know why he's done it but he deposited 600 ether which is around one million worth of the cryptocurrency to the exchange so it's hard to say what his intentions are, but he might be looking at moving a position or liquidating some of his Ethereum. It could be speculated. So that's an interesting bit of news right there. Another bit, rest in peace to this cute little dog right here, the Dogecoin Foundation. Um, you know, his name was Boltsy, lovingly known as Bauble, and to the wider internet as Cheems, the Dogecoin community and internet at large, more loss of cherished Shiba Inu. So I didn't actually know that some of these dogs were actually famous in the crypto world as well. So crazy, crazy. Um, here's one I thought I would just highlight on very lightly because it's a good reminder to keep your details as safe as possible. Don't let anyone know your email address. Don't let anybody know your phone number because you can see right here, a US SIM swapper stole $20 million in cryptocurrency and he has now been jailed so that's pretty crazy to think people are still doing scams just like that one anyhow let's jump into it guys what's going on with the crypto markets 1.05 trillion dollar valuation at the moment so about 10 percent of gold and fingers crossed we don't see more capitulation to the downside anyhow let's start with coin number one Coin number one is Conflux. I've seen a nice drop in the price of Conflux. Conflux enables creators, communities, and markets to connect across borders and protocols. It's got massive throughput, interoperability, it's secure, they're staking, it's scalable, and there are low fees. Looking at the last month, this coin's come down from 19 cents to 13 cents. So for me, it's like a buying opportunity. For me, I'm really, really tempted to buy into this and accumulate a little bit around these lower, lower levels because we're presented with an oversold position here. And when we look historically at the price, you can see it uh, actually corrected down to the 0.15 level over here. And we're sitting at 0.13 at the moment. So there's a good chance that this could be a nice area to sort of buy back into. That's my first coin I'm looking at at the moment. The next one is going to be Ape Coin. You might be thinking, oh, Ape Coin is dead. It's dead. It's dead. No one's talking about it anymore. But it still gets a tremendous amount of actual volume. 40.6 million over the last 24 hours. And in this particular month of time, we've just dropped from $2.00. 10 just in the space of a week to $1.51 so huge downtrend from $6 actually it's down quite tremendously um, I don't know how much lower it could potentially go but it is a huge downtrend and usually you know they say the trend is your friend and stuff and it probably will continue dropping a little bit as we get deeper into the bear market and see September um, of course come around but I do like buying these red days. I do think there's a chance we'll bounce back up to around that $1.78 level when the market does pick up once again. So ApeCoin I put on the list for that very, very reason. Um, if you guys don't know about ApeCoin, it's worth doing a bit of research on. The next one is going to be, oh yes, Pepe Coin. Pepe is a meme coin. It's timeless. It completely went bonkers in May. Therefore, in my opinion, it's going to be an OG now. It's an OG crypto. It's said its bed. It's made its bed in the crypto world. And I think by the next crypto bull run, we're going to see Pepe coin do something absolutely tremendous. Pepe has recently just had a massive drop in price over the last seven days. And the last day as well, we're seeing over a 10% drop in the price. So it could be potentially reflecting an opportunity here for us guys. Hard to say exactly what will happen, but in the next crypto bull run, we could actually potentially see 
a zero removed for Pepecoin because 4 billion is, you know, 4 billion market capitalization is a realistic price target for this. Remember, love of this is financial advice. And if you're new here as well, guys, get yourself into the Jacob Crypto Clan Discord down below. Over 16,000 members if you want to unlock some cool trading signals like the ones you can see on the screen right now. So the link is down in my description and comment section. Here is another one that, you know, people might miss whilst they're away because to be fair, there's only 36 days remaining for this particular pre-sale. Last chance to buy the final stage. WSM will be listed on multiple tier one centralized exchanges, which will be super nice for liquidity, getting more eyes on the project, and of course, more buyers over time. So I do hold $3,000 worth of this particular token myself, waiting for the launch, which will be hopefully soon next month in September and big things could potentially happen. They've also got staking as well. You can stake your coins, 123% APY right there, 75 rewards per block. Total supply is 2 billion tokens. And overall, I'm feeling really, really bullish on this particular ecosystem and pre-sale. Remember, it's a high risk, high reward entity. So don't ape into these things. Do your own research accordingly. Elon Musk, fun fact, did actually respond to the Twitter page twice. 262,000 followers here. And they are constantly posting like memes and stuff pushing to the world, trying to get more people involved in the pre-sale. Because the thing is, like Pepe Coin, it's all about the community and how powerful the community is behind the coin. And I hope with Wall Street memes, we're gonna see that huge level of community, which would be absolutely fantastic to see, you know, a nice pump following the launch. So there's a few coins that I'm looking at. Of course, we have Conflux token, we've got ApeCoin, we've got Pepe Coin, Wall Street memes as well, which you can find directly down below. There's a few other pre-sales there if you want to research them, that's absolutely fine. Always do your own financial advice, uh, financial research, so uh, due diligence and all that stuff that you need to do in the background. Check out the Jacob Crypto Clan that's Discord, which is down below. If you want to come hang out, just have a chat, speak to us, speak to the mods, speak to some expert traders as well. And see you soon, guys. See you soon. Take care. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment. Bye.